Hello everyone and welcome back to our Conan Exile series. I am Survivor K and last time we take we took on the uh, Warmaker Sanctuary or whatever that thing is called and killed pretty much everybody. And today we're gonna go and get some gold because we need to finish off with the purges and yeah, I need treasure and I need gold and I'm not willing to go to the pirates so we're gonna take on Almoraya. Yeah, I got everything here prepared. A uh, ton of boulders, and I don't know what's the difference between the boulders, to be honest. I have some counterweight here in the trebuchet and the salvage star metal shell. The reason I have this is because star metal is so easy to get by. So, 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 so easy. So, I got tar for the burning siege, and I want to see how that looks like. And did I get my... yes. And in the process of throwing a bunch of boulders, I need to gather some of this stuff. So what I want to do is... you can do this without the siege weaponry. You can just take a bunch of explosive jars or do the purges until you get a um, battering ram and just do it without. But I want to launch stuff in the air and I want to throw boulders at people and you know... <laughs> Make things go boom. Right, so let me put this here and see if we can craft a bunch of these. And put this here. 13. I still have 100 more, I think, or something like that um, in the chests. And how do you operate this? For those of you who don't know, if you push this, it's going to rotate. If you um, hit E on this, it's going to reload. Mine is already loaded at this point. If you hit on this, it's going to change the firing angle. And if you... Ah, thank God for nighttime. And if you touch on this, it's going to launch a projectile. Now, I don't want to launch the projectile yet because it's going to aggro um, the nasties. And I don't need the nasties now. However, I do want to try the banner and see what exactly does it do. I hope for these are not going to be that bad. Um, Mercenary banners. I got these from. Uh, okay. <laughs> this is cool. I got these from the Purge and I wanted to test them out before going um, guns blazing in the Purge. Right. I got my uh, explosive jars here. I didn't make any explosive arrows, unfortunately, but I think these should be enough to get through the third gate. And now, since this is loaded, let me see if it hits. Can you launch? Hello! <laughs> what was that? <laughs> that was so bad. <laughs> that was so bad. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Can you hit the gate, please? <laughs> Wee! Of course, it looks like this. It sounds so bad. Uh, okay, and let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Is, is this a better one? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna uh, and launch. Hello. Yes, excellent. In the middle. I don't know if that deals damage. It looks like it doesn't. Let me see uh, what this one does. <laughs> Tell me, I have to redo all of these. Uh. <laughs> Can you explode, please? Go boom. Of course not. Um. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Looks like the door is not taking any kind of damage. L let me throw one more and then switch back to the others. Of course, you hit the wall. A little bit. Excellent. Let's switch back to the, <laughs> to the ones that we have plenty of. Um, I got way more tar with me because I have plenty of tar because of the, the gear. I kept farming for the trolls, so tar is not a. <laughs> I don't know why this is so funny. Tar is not a problem. Um, let me see. Let me see. Reload and launch projectile. Can you actually hit something? Excellent. Hit the wall. Let's see. Uh, reload. Let me do compact. And throw stuff. 
it's almost good, but I'm not sure if it deals any damage. Uh, reload. Maybe I should work on the counterweight because this is this doesn't look so efficient, and nobody comes for us. So let me see. Can I put more in the counterweight? Uh, here you have 275 more. Let's see how it reacts. Reload. You reload it. Okay. And fire. Okay. Slightly better. And let's see. Can I craft more of these? No, I need tar. Where's my tar? There's my tar. Apparently, I underestimated how much tar it takes. Um, let's see. Normally, the uh, regular boulders, they are just splashing, right? They're, they're just popping and breaking when you hit. And the star metal ones, they go... Uh, around bouncing for a while, but I'm not sure <laughs> which one does more damage. And at this point, <laughs> I don't think that does anything. Um, come on, launch again. Hello. Excellent. Oh my god, it broke it. <laughs> okay, now let's push. So if you want to aim, you need to actually take a look what's in between. Here, let me. Take a look what's in between these. And this is not the door in between. This looks like it's in between. Right? Right. Almost. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, reload. And the reason why I'm going with both gates is because last time I did this, there was a problem with overspawning. So I want to break the both of the gates before... Oh my god! <laughs> I forgot about the firing angle. Okay. 5, 10, 15... I think 15 should go, and let's see after that. They deal quite a lot of damage. Fire. Okay, more to the left and less angle. <clears throat> let's see, or maybe less, less of this. Let's see. Let's counterweight. And fire. No, less angle. Definitely less angle. The angle 15 was, let's try with 10. 55, 65. This is the problem with them. Trebuchet at this point. When you keep... Mm, let's try with 5 first. When, when you go above the... Um, above the angle, you cannot go back. So you have to go all the way, reset the angle, and then come back to the... Uh, lower value. Let's see. <laughs> it's <real> okay. <laughs> and if I take away this, are you gonna fire properly? Now it's projectile. What projectile, my guy? We don't have any projectiles. Uh, let's do this. Okay, excellent. Now it needs to be more left. Oh, too much, maybe. Let's see. And fire! Yes, right in the door. Right in the door. Load and fire! <laughs> oh my god, it's ruining it. Load and... Come on, come on, come on. Fire! Excellent. One more, one more, one more. Load. There we go. Almost, almost, almost. More, more. Man, the angle is, is really, really right there. Excellent. I don't think these do anything. <laughs> I needed the demon fire also along with these. <laughs> Just sake. Um, yeah, it looks like that. <laughs> let me let me take all of this because it's it looks like it's junk. <laughs> let me put the star metal. Okay, I tried it. So apparently you need to let this on fire with something, and if I remember correctly, you can. Um, 
you can actually do this with the demon fire barrage thingy but i'm not willing to spend this amount of time if you don't know the demon fire thing is expensive and i'm not willing to spend this amount of time grinding just for uh nothing right so i'm not gonna do the demon fire thing i don't even know it apparently right and let's see can you load and fire fire come on fire oh ah, you're not loaded with the dish hello fire yes excellent and load again and fire now the build that i'm using is full encumbrance because you're gonna see why <laughs> As soon as I get there. And load and fire. And I'm rolling with agility because I like the weapons. So load. Maybe move a little bit. Oh, too much. Fire. Yeah, too much. Oh. Load. And fire again. Come on. Yes, right in the door. Load again. Hello. And fire again. And that door is stubborn. Yes, excellent. And now we go in and do the crazy stuff. Um, I don't need this. I don't need this. I don't need this. And I definitely don't need this. I will need this, however. And I'm not sure if I should put it there. Maybe here. And actually, you know what? Let's put it here. Right. Now let's go in and do some damage because hey, don't fight these guys here. They're gonna or last time I tried it, they kept spawning. So I just want to <laughs> skip everything here and go straight to where I know a battering ram is and try not to uh, anger too many and cheese it a little bit, right? See ya. Plenty, plenty of people, plenty of people. Let me see, can I find the thing there? But I need to fight these guys first. Right. Oops. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Come on, come on. Hello. Come on, do the black hole thing. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Yes, the Void Incursion is up. Excellent. Right. I didn't get all of them, but it's still better than nothing, to be honest. And I will need all of this and this. And let me drink something. Why did I drink before? Come on, come on. Come on outside. Yes, yes. Join the black hole. And there's another one. Two, three, whoops. And now I need the second AoE weapon. There we go. Hello. Why did you res how did you respond so fast? Jesus. I didn't kill everybody there or what was the gist of it? Huh. Interesting. Anyways, um, this is why you need, kinda need to cheese it a little bit if you're going solo and no thralls and no nothing because there are too many, way too many. So, <laughs> so you need to you need to be smarter, a few minutes smarter than them. And let's see, I see you, I see you. Where did you come from, my guy? Why are you so many keep spawning from there? Jesus. Yep. There we go. Here we go with the... And you should be dead soon. I'm not gonna loot all of them because apparently it's gonna keep respawning and I'm gonna be stuck in the loop. But I am gonna search for... battering ram if i can 
And we got nothing. And look, another one. And another one here. And maybe I can do the void. Yes. Excellent. And let me pop out the corruption. Wait for the void to go out because, you know. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. The void is amazing against these guys. The void is amazing in general. It the only problem is if you don't go fully corrupted, it's gonna eat at your supplies. Otherwise, my god, this weapon is gorgeous. A bit broken if you ask me. Oh, and there we go. The battering ram. Right, now I need to break the third door. And <laughs> of course they got back. Of course they got back. Then we go up. Void incursion ready. Excellent. And what I did first time when these were all broken and they kept spawning and spawning and spawning and spawning. Um, I went there sneakily. I just dropped a whatever this thing. What's it called? The jar. Yeah. And broke it and then ran away. Let them de aggro, rinse and repeat. Because they were simply too many spawning and kept spawning and spawning and always spawning so it's not really fun when it's broken like that so it's uh, yeah okay okay now we got them there let me put this here good the drink Okay, this looks like a bug on the mod. Like, if you trigger the void, probably any kind of damage, and you equip the bow, any kind of damage is going to trigger the bow effect, which is not... I don't think that's intended. It is severely broken if it is intended, to be honest. Anyways, this is not going to change much because we don't have any um, ally with us to actually benefit of it. But uh, still, I think it's worth taking a look into. Hello. I can't believe I killed this guy. And the void didn't trigger. Jesus, man. Didn't you... Mm. Void, can you please do your thing? Thank you. Ouch! Yeah, there's way too many. Way too many. Void incursion should be ready soon. Ouch! Hello! <laughs> don't die, don't die, don't die. Just run away and check potions. Excellent. Yeah, and they spawned again. Right, so this is this is what I'm talking about. They didn't really fix this. They just keep spawning and spawning and spawning. So you need to pay really to be really really careful with these because yeah, they can swarm you pretty easily. And I don't know where I'm getting the cripple from, but I'm getting crippled. Excellent. And another one just spawned right there. Ah. <laughs> Look at how many are there. Wow. Where did you come from, my guy? Two. And he hit me. Whoa. Full combo. And another one. And by the time I'm gonna be done with them, they're gonna spawn again. So this is why I'm using this. Right. It's broken. Um, I don't think Funko. <laughs> and then they're up again. Look at how many corpses there are. 
they're up again. This is the problem. This is Funcom's problem, and I don't think they're gonna fix it anytime soon. Like, take a look at how many they spawn and keep spawning and spawning and spawning. This is insane. Let me see. Can I do this? Yes. And run away. And then equip another one. I hope I have enough. To be honest. I'm not sure. Just go away. Come on. I'm gonna fight you all. Hello! Excellent. And just keep piling them up there. I know, I know, it's not pretty. It's not pretty at all. But then again, what can we do? Because it's it's really Funcom issue. So until they fix this, I mean, who wants to see constant respawn every three seconds on the mobs? I don't know. And rinse and repeat. And you can do this without any mods on vanilla also. Right, the build is not uh, changed, is not um, altered in any way. You just need to farm these explosive jars, put them there. It's gonna be the uh, easiest way in and out, right? Unless you wanna kind of work with the trebuchet and hope it's gonna work. <laughs> I don't know. And another problem is if they keep spawning like this, you cannot really explore properly. Almaraya, because it's... And now I'm gonna die. No, 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 no. Come on. What's happening? Excellent. And apparently I didn't die. <laughs> I don't know what happened there, but something happened. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> go away, please go away. <laughs> My god. Everything is booming, man. Jesus. <laughs> okay. Let me see, let me see. Can I put... No, I cannot. It's still burning. If it's burning, they're gonna just explode immediately. So, we need to pace ourselves. I hope I have enough. Though. Because... Ule guy there is not happy I'm booming his door. And he's gonna call his buddies. Just saying. Another one. And then we have only one more, and then we need to rely on the battering ram. Or go... Come back after I grab some more, and break the doors again. Hello! Can I get out? Thank you. Jesus. Yes! Was enough. Right, and now it's another problem. <laughs> there are too many here, too. <laughs> Hello. And the reach is insane on them. I don't know how I'm getting crippled all the time. It's, it's like they have archers everywhere and they just keep shooting me. Right, let's see. Can we cheese you right here? No, we cannot. Apparently. You're way too many. Way too eager to fight. And now we have to avoid that. Great, 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 great. There we go. 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 Really love this void thing. It's really making this playable, actually. Right. They're down. And I'm gonna... I'm gonna decorrupt myself until we go further up. I don't have any more. Maybe I have one more. So probably I'm gonna use it a bit further up. I do not own this. Of course I do not own this. Jesus. And here's the pillage. Right. And these guys... They should be less of a threat now. They should be manageable. And I do need to pay attention because they have plenty of armor. They're no joke. And inside here I don't really want to use the Void Incursion. Because... Um, and by the way, any door is fine if you uh, break open. I don't want to use any Void Incursion because I'm not sure how it's going to affect the loot up top. So it's better to be safe than sorry, at least this time. Right. 
go boom. And now we need to break them. One, two, excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. And now there are too many. And probably here I'm gonna need a void incursion. Yeah, I'm gonna use the void incursion here. You guys are nasty. There we go. That was a lucky one. Right. That was a really lucky one. Let's go a little bit there so they can get grabbed. And now use the poison daggers here. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. Right. And I have just this guy left. This guy is not that bad. But the void incursion is apparently. Right. Don't hit me. Hand of War. This is the guy that comes for the purges also, by the way. Just so you know. In case you wondered. Hello. And you're gonna go down. Excellent. And I got the Demon Fire Orb. I think the Demon Fire Orb also... Um... Sorry, also affects buildings, if I remember correctly. And these guys you can safely loot because they're not gonna respawn anytime soon. At least, at least these guys. Jesus. And we got here, press E to interact. We don't own this. Um, but I do own this. Hello? Eh, anyway. It doesn't look like there's anything there, though. There's a door that goes outside. If I were still gonna have battering rams available, battering ram available, I'm gonna go there also. Right, so, next door. One, two, three, four. Please open the door. <laughs> Let me cleanse corruption. <laughs> right. Excellent. Good. Let's see what's up there. And up here is the treasure. And here I'm not going to be able to use the void. Holy. What the fudge? And no, 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 this is not going to be good. Let's go down. The reason why it's not going to be good is the orb guys are broken. And I cannot heal properly with them. So I'd much rather go down here. And kill this. Whee! This guy is nasty. Commander, but Jesus. Okay. Holy John, I almost died. Can I drop my bedroll here? Question. Land is clean. Of course not. Um, can I kill you? Of course not. Uh, come here, bud. Come here, buddy. No? Come here, come here, come here. I can void you. Here I can void you. Up there I don't want to void. Hello. Knock it off. You're hitting a ton. I'm telling you. A ton. And you went down there. And you got away from the void. Of course. Can you come back up? Are you capable enough? That is the question. Let me see. Are you still down here? No, you're not. So, probably here is... Huh. Maybe he reset? Because I really want to kill him. Yeah, he did reset. And you need to die, my guy. So I can actually fight him. Excellent. Let the fire go out. Yeah, the orbs guys are broken. Any kind of orb guy, doesn't matter where it comes from, they're broken. Um, you cannot dodge properly, the damage is gonna break your healing. You know, all the all the good stuff that everybody loves to, to see in a fight, right? 
Excellent. Now let's fight. One to one, my guy. One to one. Uh, if you if you're stuck, I'm gonna take the freebie. Just saying. Ouch. Apparently you're not stuck enough. Hello. And no poison pool? Are you for real? Come on. Come on, come on. Drop the poison pool. Ouch. Holy John, he sundered with everything. Yeah. Kinda need to wait this under. Let's see. Hello? I don't get it. Why? Hey, finally! It took you only 90 freaking hits to trigger it. Excellent. Let's pop up the katana and he's done for. Holy John! No, I'm done for. Sorry. <laughs> it's calculated. Jesus. Nah, he's done for. Good, good, good. A little bit of... a little too much of a cheese if you ask me, but hey. And that's the horn for me defeating them. Um, I don't need any of this. Uh, Brazier. And here is why we came with the um, weight. Look at the amount of gold. Just look at the mountains and mountains and mountains of gold. That was insane. Uh, stick in table. I don't own it. Uh, what else do you have? Uh, yeah, I can take this. The reason why I want to take this is maybe, maybe, maybe I can get some sand reaper egg and make a sand reaper queen uh, down there. These guys hit hard, so be very, very careful with them. And we still got some some of this. I know Musashi Black Blade is around here somewhere, but eh, I don't really care much about it, if I'm honest, because we do have some really, really powerful uh, weapons. So I just want to explore a little bit uh, on the outside see what happens but this was Almeria. this was the siege of Almeria. it's pretty straightforward if you know what you're doing if you don't know what you're doing it's pretty broken because um funcom decided it's not worth fixing a broken respawn rate right and broke the battering ram can i still use this huh. can i still use this Okay, lower. Yes, I can still use this. And another reinforced door. Uh, apparently, there's not much here. Right. Three, four, <laughs> five. I don't need these demon fire orbs anyway, so. Let's see. Can you break the door? Can you break the door? Of course not. Can you break the door? Yes, you can. Let's see. Every reinforced door. I don't know how much damage this is due to the door, but I'm gonna poke at it. I'm gonna be persistent for a little while until I get bored. <laughs> Let's see. Can I can I poke with you? Maybe I can poke better with you. Yeah, I can see some wear and tear pieces there, but it doesn't look like this is efficient and it doesn't look like it's going to break soon and this really doesn't look like it's going to have anything around there. So let me go check here and here is empty also and apparently nothing. Let me see if the door is still open. And go check, poke around some other places, see if we can find the battering ram, maybe. If not, not. What can I say? Right. So, that was all Mariah. Um, 
if you ask me, it's a little bit anticlimactic. It's it's good content, mind you. I really enjoyed it. Um, and apparently I should have broken this door because this door has loot and this door has nothing, but that door has loot. And I don't find, I didn't find any other, maybe the void can trigger on the doors. Let's see. Apparently not. One more? No? No, it doesn't look like it. And it doesn't look like it's gonna break anytime soon. Either. Can I still crack it open though? Looks like not. Anyways. I should have brought another battering ram. Maybe the one there spawned? If it didn't spawn, I guess we wasted the banner, but at least now I know what they do. <laughs> at least now I know what they do. <laughs> Excellent. Right, do we still have a battering ram here? No, of course not. Can we run away and check if we have a battering ram anywhere else? Looks like nothing there, nothing there. Nothing there, nothing there, here, maybe, nothing here, right, just a bunch of angry guys that don't let me get away, uh, nothing there, we do have a dragon jar there though, ooh, we have plenty actually, huh, maybe it's worth getting though, do we have anything here? No. Okay, okay. This is getting really dangerous. Especially with the guys that don't let me heal. For some reason. Right. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. And maybe we can trigger the void? Yes. Take the void. Be one with the void. Yes. Go inside the dark hole. Leave me the fudge alone. <laughs> Let me see. Maybe I can take these and explode the door. Because I really want to see what's inside. Probably is the, the blade is there. And yeah, without I don't know what I would have done without the void thing. I mean, I did do it before, but it was not pretty to watch. So Funcom should really fix this. <laughs> <laughs> should really fix this. I mean, you need to bring a freaking army to be able to reach this point, and that is if you already broke the doors. One, two, good enough. Great. Now, what do we have here? Press E to interact. You don't own this. So why did I even break it? <laughs> You're telling me this was for nothing. My god. Seriously? Ah. Fine. Let's break this one too since we're here and that's it. One. And second. And now let's check what's inside. Bunch of barrels. Bunch of more barrels. So, nothing. All in all, it was for nothing. Right, let's get out of here because we've been uh, we've been at it for a little longer than it was needed. And we have a battering ram here. Wait, 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 wait. Hang on. <laughs> I need to explore this a bit more. <laughs> I didn't expect the battering ram there. Let's see, maybe we have some hidden loot here somewhere. I don't know. I know at this point it feels like I'm wasting time, but hey. <laughs> it is what it is. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. We get the siege thing. Get the battering ram. And this is the way we broke excellent and now let's see the wound can we break this one two three and we're in and it's nothing one 
Two. <laughs> Four. And nothing. <laughs> this is amazing, man. I swear to God. Great content. Great content. From my side and from Funcom's side. Great content. It's really a bunch of nothing. <laughs> It's seriously not even a chest. Why do you put all of this here if you're not gonna populate it with anything? I don't know, man. This is underwhelming. Like, it's really not... Look at the mountains of empty rooms. Like, at least put something in here. <laughs> Decorate it. Put a mini boss. I don't know. Something. Some gold. Anything. At this point, anything would do. And the last one... I don't believe he's gonna have anything, but Harry, let's just break this and get it done with. Right, and now we should go out. Because, as I said, we've been at it a little too long and it wasn't really that fruitful. Um, after you get to the main treasure room. There's really not much to be seen. If you want to keep fighting here, by all means keep fighting here. I don't see the point and I don't see the uh, use of it. So I'm just going to keep <laughs> running away until they get fed up with me. Or until I get fed up of running and fight them. Right, go back, go back. Anyways. This. This was all Mariah. Right, so thank you very much for sticking this long. Um, it did feel a little bit like it, it's it's a cool idea. It's a really cool idea to have something like this to siege in the middle of the desert. But ah. <laughs> there's a but, of course. And yeah, I do hope they're gonna build up on this idea in chapter four, and I can't wait to see what they come with, come up with for. Uh, Sipta, because this one, aside for the main room, there's no point in exploring even, so yeah, pay attention to the spawn rates if you're doing this, um, be very, very careful, don't get stuck in fighting the mobs, because they're gonna keep respawning, as you've seen, right in your face. Um, I didn't see any kind of way to just make them stop, um, ideally, and I think the layer behind the door should stop respawning constantly as soon as you break the door. That was my thought of it, but it looks like it's not the Funcom's thought. So, yeah, it is what it is. Plenty of spawn. Be very careful with it. There's not much to explore outside the uh, loot room. So, there's that. And I guess that was it. We got plenty of treasure. And now we're ready for the purchase. Thank you very much, guys, for sticking this long. Don't forget to do the whole YouTube Trinity. Like, share, subscribe, spread the love. And see you guys next time.